What if the Yellowstone supervolcano decided to wake up tomorrow? Join us as we dive into this thrilling yet terrifying scenario and uncover the hidden secrets of one of Earth's most powerful geological features. Welcome to our channel. Today, we're taking a deep dive into Yellowstone National Park. A breathtaking natural wonder and home to one of the world's most formidable supervolcanoes. We'll explore the beauty above and the power lurking below, and address the burning question. Is there any real threat of an eruption? Let's find out. Yellowstone National Park, located in Wyoming, is not just America's oldest national park, but also a geological marvel. For a mere $35 entry fee, visitors can explore its vast expanse of 2.2 million acres. You'll encounter breathtaking mountains, iconic geysers like Old Faithful, and a diverse array of wildlife, including bears, wolves, and bison. It's a haven for nature enthusiasts, offering everything from panoramic hiking trails to vibrant hot springs. But beneath this picturesque landscape lies something far more formidable, a supervolcano. This geological giant is responsible for the park's famous hot springs and geysers. But it also holds the potential for cataclysmic eruptions. A supervolcano is not just a larger version of a typical volcano, it's a colossal force of nature. To be classified as a supervolcano, it must have had at least one eruption expelling over 1,000 cubic kilometers of material. For perspective, the 1980 eruption of Mount St. Helens released less than 3 cubic kilometers. Yellowstone's most significant eruption occurred around 2.1 million years ago, releasing about 2,450 cubic kilometers of material. This event, among others, has shaped the park's unique geology. The Yellowstone caldera, the volcanic crater beneath the park, has experienced three major eruptions, the last occurring approximately 640,000 years ago. Since then, numerous smaller volcanic events have indicated ongoing geological activity. Imagine a supervolcano as a massive pressure cooker. Magma rises from the Earth's mantle but is held back by the crust. As pressure builds, the ground bulges until it erupts explosively, releasing enormous amounts of lava, ash, and debris. Yellowstone has had four major caldera events, creating huge underground chambers of molten rock that gradually refill. An eruption would have catastrophic effects, spreading ash globally, darkening skies, and potentially triggering a volcanic winter. Despite the low probability of an imminent eruption, scientists monitor the area closely. If it did erupt, it would release the energy of a thousand Hiroshima bombs in a second, causing massive earthquakes, shockwaves, widespread destruction, and nearly a million casualties. A 2014 study by scientists Larry Maston, Alexa Van Eaton, and Jacob Lowenstern highlighted that a Yellowstone supervolcano eruption could bury vast areas of the U.S. in ash, disrupt global climate, and threaten ecosystems. Despite these possibilities, an imminent eruption is unlikely. Frequent earthquakes and ground swelling in Yellowstone are not definitive signs of an eruption. Scientists closely monitor these activities with advanced technology, ensuring clear warnings before any major event. Current studies show that while Yellowstone's magma chamber is large, the amount of melted magma is low, reducing the chance of a massive eruption in the near future. Smaller volcanic activities, such as hydrothermal eruptions, are more common and pose less global risk. Yellowstone's geothermal features, including its iconic geysers and vibrant hot springs, serve as natural laboratories for understanding volcanic behavior. These features are direct indicators of the geothermal energy beneath the park, where heat from the Earth's mantle interacts with water, creating the spectacular displays we see on the surface. Geysers like Old Faithful erupt with remarkable regularity, while hot springs showcase a stunning array of colors due to thermophilic bacteria. These phenomena not only captivate visitors, but also provide critical data for scientists studying the dynamics of Earth's crust and the magmatic systems beneath Yellowstone. Advanced monitoring techniques, such as satellite-based remote sensing, seismographs, ground deformation measurements, 